So it is good to see videos like this coming from one of our Nigeria brothers. So it's not only bad news that we'll be sharing on this platform, and it's not only bad news about um, Nigerians in the diaspora or Nigerians in the UK that we will be bringing to you. If we see good videos like this, something good that our Nigeria brothers or sisters have done, it's also good for us to share with you all. That is why I'm here with a very interesting, motivating video for every one of us today. One of our Nigerian brothers is also a content creator. He lives here in the UK, live and work here in the UK. Hmm. Known as MC Akonishe on TikTok and on Facebook, you can go check him out. This guy just did something very, very fantastic. Something that has got a lot of people, especially a lot of Nigerians in the diaspora talking at the moment. But in the meantime, before we go further to see this video of our brother, if you are meeting me for the first time, I welcome you to my channel. My name is Joanne Ekeke and I'm based here in England. On this very channel, I bring to you life realities of Nigerians that are based here in the UK and in the diaspora at large. So if you are interested in content like this, before leaving this very video, click on the subscribe button. It is free. Subscribing is free. I wonder why some of us are not subscribing. And I want to say thank you to every one of you for 10,000 subscribers. Guys, I didn't really see this coming. Thank you sincerely from my heart. I appreciate all your support. And for my returning subscribers, thanks for coming back. I appreciate you all. With that being said, let's go straight into today's video. So I saw the video trending on the cyberspace of one of our Nigerian brothers known as MC Akonoshe. He's a medical lab technician here in the UK. He studied and is working now here in the UK. So this our brother went back home to Nigeria to build a very befitting mansion for his parents. A lot of people have been applauding this our brother, including me. Yes, I said it is good because it's not all the time that will bring to you in Nigeria has been arrested in the UK. In Nigeria, who is in the UK has been this and that. At least when we see things like this, we should also bring it to encourage and motivate those of us that are in the UK that, okay, it's not only bills, bills, bills that people are paying. People can still do something good, something better from that little they are earning or from the money they are earning here in the UK. When I know say the talk and say, there is no place like home. So this our brother built a very befitting mansion for his parents. According to him, he said they've suffered a lot. Like, you know, those people that family will contribute money to send you abroad. And at the end of the day, you know, you don't want to disappoint them. This is what this our brother did. He did not disappoint them. He went back home, built a very befit. In fact, I'm talking too much now. Let's see the video from our brother. And then I personally will be back with the rest of my thoughts, what I think about this very video. Parents, back home, I travel all the way from the UK to come down to give my parents this house. These people have really suffered. Like, you will not have an idea. These are my wonderful parents, guys. And I am so, so happy. This is my dad. Come close, come close, come close. Yes, as well. And this is my mom, my very beautiful mother. They did so well to train me. And then to send me to a good school, good primary school, good secondary school, good university. And I am so, so happy today to give them this house. I need you guys to just see it. Let them see. No, not see them. Let them see. Not a joke. You get it. It's not a joke. So I'm really grateful. And my parents are there. And that's just a little way for me to appreciate them. It's no prank. It's no prank. You know you say prank. You know they do prank. I had them a prank. I had them a real. We we'll see. We we'll see. I just want to say thank you so much for the scala pain that you have done for scala me. Food. Scala food. Eh? For scala everything food. that you guys have done for me. For everything you guys have done for me. Thank you so much. 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 Thank you so much
And that's my manager all the way from the UK. Who just came. I'm so good. 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 I'm so Yes, so by people, anything you are doing in this life, always remember family. Hmm? This is the opening of the house by Reverend Okbara. Now, Christian family, I come on the name of the Father and the name of the Son. And then in the name of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Family is everything. And I gospel and a very Christian family I come from. No reason I call on Facebook to talk about knack. <laughs> I love my parents so much. These people are amazing. Almost uh, the best parents ever. And of course, I love my siblings. They are the best thing that ever happened to me in the whole world. Family is always number one. Don't forget family. Eh? No matter any way you do, because last, last, you go back to your family. Mm? I'm so, so glad. And then I've been watching people giving houses to their parents. Today is my turn. And now, the engineer that that built this house, engineer Ekenel, he was my classmate, secondary school, university. Thank God, saying the copy note. If not, I for no give him this contract. Now, I build your house. Oh contact him this is his phone number this guy was so good you know chop one naira of my money ladies and gentlemen so as you can see this is where we used to live this is where they see like this now that is where we used to live within a short period of time god did everything now let me show you where we are living now eh? Yes, sir. This is where we now live now. Poverty will die in Jesus' name. <laughs> if none of your person do, you do you go. Make all of you now gather money, contribute money. Give one person in travel. <laughs> so now, for the first time, my mom is going to live in a house that is painted, that has towels, that we get fridge, we get we get everything. Like girls now will be like hotel. See now. So let me take you on a tour to my house. Come. So let me show you my house now. You understand? Yes, to sit the house. Let me take you to the sitting room. You want where they come panel? Wow! Woo! Yes, so that's <laughs> It's not easy. Yeah, a pal gave me this portrait when I landed in Nigeria. Yes, that's it. Uh -huh. Show them this Chandelier life. Let them know. Let them know. Say no one, uh, man. Uh, wait, so, wait, wait, wait. Yes, they don't let them wait. See him. Get different colors. You understand? Okay. And then this is the dining. The dining. Why hey! do you bring food and beg? <laughs> I have seen this thing to be coming back. Before I decide, I'm going to go to my house. I'm lying. I'm going to go. I'll say a chop. Open fridge. What's the big thing? See what you do, please. Hey, man! Hey, hey, hey! 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 Hey, hey,
My mom's room should be the other one. Let's go up. Yes, sir. According to where they see one, according to yes, according to my brother's room, you got in my own room, according to another of my brother, there's another big pile of upstairs, so they never furnish this one, according to the light, and then in the sit house. You know, if you didn't find me, they come. I don't really excite you. You understand? <laughs> and then, the essence of this video not to show up in But I will not be watching the current section. But whatever thing you do, just know that hard work pays. You understand? Don't worry. Keep struggling. One day, we we'll get there. This is me today. This is where I am now. This is where I used to be. That's where I used to be. You see where I am right now. All right. You can share this video with me. Now, why would I never see me for social media? I go Nigeria. Oh yeah. Welcome back, guys. I hope we've seen the video of our brother. Yes, I say very big congratulations to him. You know, as parents, when you've taught very hard. You've worked very hard to train your children and then you see those children in return becoming blessings to you, blessing your life and looking after you when you are old. You know, the joy that comes with that is unimaginable, it's unexplainable. So once again, congratulations to the parents of MC Akonushi and thanks to our brother who is making us proud once again in the UK. Is a medical lab um, scientist, is working presently in the UK after studying, is doing well. So I just want to encourage some of us who are newly relocating to the UK today that see there's light at the end of the tunnel. This our brother has already made every one of us proud. This our brother has made us to understand that you coming to the UK today and things are rough doesn't mean that that is how it's going to stay or be forever. There's indeed light at the end of the tunnel. Once again, I say congratulations to him. MC Akonishi, we acknowledge you. Thank you very much for putting smile on the faces of your family, for not letting them down. And I want to encourage us as well, those of us that are studying in the UK, just be focused. Be serious with your studies. Do not always look for shortcuts. Shortcuts sometimes is not always short. Yes, guys, I'll see you in my next video. Have a wonderful day. Bye.